The ADHD report is in. Here are some of the biggest areas of agreement. A national framework for ADHD that is fully government funded and co-designed with ADHD as our families and advocacy organizations. A review of the Medicare benefit schedule, including a review for bulk billing and for service providers like psychologists, and nurses. A review of the pharmaceutical benefits scheme, including increased subsidized medication options and a consistent approach to regulation across Australia. The report is recommending big improvements for ADHDers in spaces like education and employment. A big increase uh, to the training made available for people working in those spaces and making sure that that training is neurodiversity affirming. At the same time, there are still gaps to fill. There's no clear call for a disability minister, which we know is so important. Only a reference to a task force, which just doesn't cut it. And there is really wishy-washy language around the NDIS. No clear call for ADHD to be included as a primary disability or for a culture shift so that people with ADHD and people with psychosocial disabilities are no longer excluded. I am so proud of the work that we have done together to get these big recommendations on the table. At the same time, there are still gaps to fill and it is over to us to do it.